Hey, it's AAA, and welcome to Survival Sundays. You guys wanted this? You're getting this. You're going to be playing a survival game every Sunday, starting a new series. This will be also in placing, in, replacing inscription slot when inscription's done. When inscription is done, this will move over to any day, and then a different survival game will go in this slot. So I thought that'd be a nice way to kind of ease the game in. We're going to be playing Resident Evil 2, Leon Kennedy's Route, might play it through again as Claire, haven't decided. Uh, I was gifted this by my friend uh, VGalaxy, love her to bits. Uh, she doesn't Twitch stream anymore, I don't think, but if she comes back, I'll let y'all know. Uh, costumes, we're going to be playing with the alt costumes, and I'm going to be wearing the noir, because why would I not wear the noir costume when it looks like that? Not with the noir screen filter, though. I struggle enough to see... I, I struggle enough to see. Let's go. Uh, I'm going to play it standard. I don't want weaker enemies. I do need aim assist. Aim assist is enabled. But I don't need the certain amount of health. I'm going to play it standard. I typically play assisted because, you know, legally blind. But I think I can change it later to assisted if I need it. Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was... Disgustingly high-res burger. I don't like it. She was staggering, you know? So I, I figured she was drunk. Whoa, <laughs> whoa, whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now. How many drinks did you have? No, oh, man, I, I barely had a buzz on. Oh, come on. I'm going to try not to talk during the cutscenes, by the way. Sounds like you need a divorce. Because <laughs> he sucks, not because she sucks, to clarify. Yeah. I need some sleep. Boom! Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Saw that coming. I've seen Train to Busan. Can we just talk about that her face didn't look infected at all, from what we could see? <laughs> oh, I look so good! I would dress noir if I could p get away with it. I feel like I could pull it off. But I would dress that era clothing every day if I could. I wonder if she'll be in the uh when we see Claire if she'll be in noir clothing. That's weird. Or if she'll be in the alt clothing. Yeah. Curious if my uh I would keep an eye on my heart rate monitor. Because I have a heart condition as well. I can play horror games. It's not like I'm banned from it. But I'm very curious how it'll... How my heart will react. I would like to get the gun out of my car. Or not. I 
Also, it's very funny, me being very anti-cop, playing as a cop. <laughs> I'll try not to interrupt too many of his dialogues with my anti-copness, but it might happen once or twice. Or three or four times. But that's what you watch me for, right? Anybody there? It's not because I'm good at games, it's because I talk, I talk, and I talk in a funny way. Something's not right. Correct. There's blood on the ground. If there was blood on the ground and something was right, then you need therapy. I hear br heavy breathing over here. Pained heavy breathing. Hello? You all right? No. They are most clearly not. Don't move. I'll be back for you. Okay. If a guy who's holding his neck and is bleeding points us somewhere, we should not logically go there. However, I am a horror game protagonist. Shut up, bottles. Are you gonna save me with a cutscene or you're gonna make me do this? You're gonna make me do this. Hello. Stop moving. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir, I got this. You do not, in fact, got this. Oh. That's so in my headphones. Like Ooh, you're getting creepy. I'll shoot. Shit. Really? That's not a great sign. Fuck. You don't have a head. <laughs> you are like You better not be alive still. I plan on... I, I, You're gonna turn, I bet. Key. Don't look at the poster, Twitch viewer. You'll get me in trouble. No tubes or bits. You don't have a face. How are you moving? There you go. I'll give you a chance. No way. This can't be. I assume you're made extra strong for this first cutscene. It's a lot of ammo. They're making me use a lot of ammo early. Which worries me. Let's just get out of here. Oh god, the running feels weird. Hey, what are you doing? Excuse me. No leaving for me? No leaving for you. It magically gave me bullets back. I appreciate that. Or I can't count. One of the two. Uh, window broke. I heard that. Ah! Using key items. <laughs> use... You're gonna make me manually... Use. And... Jump scare? Whoa! Hello! What the? I assume that guy behind me turned too? Correct. Let's let's leave, shall we? Oh, she's in the noir as well. Get down. I like the noir. I don't know if I like it as much on her though, because on her it just kind of looks a little. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I was hoping it'd be like she would look clean and cool like me, but instead she kind of looks like a bad cosplayer. I can change the costumes partway through. Hold on. So 
So I'll take your feedback on those. Or I might just experiment with different costumes in different sessions. I feel like I'm having to talk very loud because the game is very loud. I might turn down my headset. There we go. Also, I changed my mind. She looks much better up close than in that weird, like, face-to-face -face cutscene thing. Though I stand by the fact that it... Like, if she wore the tie more like a tie... Might look better. I know, I'm in a zombie apocalypse and I'm judging their fashion. Deal with it. Bite me. Ha <laughs> ha! Capcom presents this Dr. Pepper I'm about to take a sip of. This all looks great, by the way. It's gorgeous. Which I would expect nothing less. And I don't know if I'm going to be playing Resi 4. Probably not anytime soon, because I cannot afford to just buy it full price right now. But here we are. RE2. Also, there were survivors up until, like, a minute ago, when we bundled, blun but blundered the gas station incident. To be fair, we had no way of knowing. Looks like we're walking from here. I hope you give me more bullets. Though I do know this game is known for its infamous difficulty. And I should reserve ammo and stuff. I should check. Oh, I can't hear. Okay. Oh, it's you. Hi, you. There, get out. Get out now. window break. No, what am I kidding? We just went through a hell of a crash. <laughs> the fact our legs aren't shit. <laughs> Was that necessary? <laughs> I don't know. It was fun. Get to the police station. Bye. I mean, have you ever seen an in-control zombie apocalypse? Yes, yes I have. There are several shows and movies in which it is in control. Or at least should be if logic was a thing. Can I get through this gap? No, I can't. I see an alley. I'm going for the alley. 
realistically do not go into an alley in this situation. However, shit. It's everybody. They all turned. Tie. T I. <laughs> not just randomly yelling about my tie. But my tie looks quite nice. That's why I chose the noir. I'm I might need to adjust the visibility settings because I did it the way they told me to and I'm struggling to see. I should have thought about the fact that they made that for not visually impaired people. That made that for normal people to experience the scary in the way they want them to. Welcome to Raccoon Police Department. Oh, welcome to the City of the Dead. I just got the achievement. That's a nice gun. But unfortunately, I kept my ammo from earlier. Which is not great. Hello? Oh, it's actually quite visible in here. Costumes have been added. Yeah. Oh, I can change them partway through. Costumes. I'm just saying this. Don't want the noir. As you can see, like I can enable our normal outfits, the alternative outfits, and then there's also what is this? Is she a racer? Is that why there's a bodysuit, or is there a bodysuit option because it's the internet? Military noir. The military actually looks quite nice. I'll be honest, but I'm gonna stick with noir. I'm also going to change my options. Can I change difficulty in here? No. Noted. So I guess I, I am stuck in no, normal difficulty Anybody even if here? I should have chosen. Oh, wait, I know. I should also check. Did aim assist stay on when I put that on for myself? Auto reload. Yes, aim assist stayed on. Thank God. That will be required. Thank you for the bullets. Raccoon Police Department. There has to be someone here. Hey, look, it's a someone. Not good. Also means there's zombies in here. Oh, no. Oh no, my reinforcements? I shouldn't be. Gotta find that guy. I better not be reinforcements, I'm bad reinforcements. Nice. Deluxe weapons added. Samurai Edge Albert model. 15 shot capacity, 9mm. Based on a design by At Albert Wesker himself. Customized for robust performance. Can I combine that with that? No, okay. Can I unload the four shots out of it? <laughs> no, I cannot. Does that defy logic? Absolutely. Am I really that bothered about it? No. Actually, can I combine... No, it's not gonna... Okay. Goodbye, four shots for a gorgeous pistol. Did it reinforcements east hallway, right? I don't have the thing for that. I assume I need something to rip through that industrial tape. Because I have weak, poor protagonist hands. East hallway. I'm not going to try and brute force that. Despite what you've seen from my inscription playthrough. I know this game has... More fully fleshed designed puzzles. Inscriptions puzzles kind of felt like an afterthought. Uh, if I reload... 
Yes, we have a smart protagonist. Maybe I should have kept the other pistol on me. You know what, that's not a bad idea. When I'm running low on ammo, I'll pull out the bad pistol and use its four shots. And then just not reload it. No, that feels like an unnecessary amount of min-maxing. Which is exactly why I'm here for it. I am just trying to find an open frickin' door. Here we go. Please. Why can't... Some doors I click, some doors I just walk into. Green herb. Restores a small amount of health. I chose standard difficulty, which means I don't have health regen. So, uh... Yeah. Hello. Oh, God. <laughs> What's that other thing? No, stop it. I want this. Show me this. Guide pamphlet. Did you know? We are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation. Didn't notice. Wasn't always a police mu station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. There's an orphanage. She blocks away, run by Umbrella Corporation. I wish we I could say, that's suspicious, because it is, but unfortunately, real companies are like that. <laughs> they have their hands in everything. Someone took a sh bullet into the back of this PC? Or is it just a very badly rendered uh, plug? Badly rendered plug. <laughs> Don't have the key for that. I have not seen a combination lock. Ah, making use of the map. Useful for more than just current locations. Show any points of interest at items you found but haven't picked up. Cool. That's point of interest safe. Point of interest lion statue. Bad of the first thing I thought of when I saw that balcony is, like, gave me, uh, John Wilkes Booth vibes. Like, you kind of stand up there to, like, pop a shot down. I know he didn't pop a shot down at Lincoln. He shot him in the back or whatever. But, shush. It's a funny joke. It probably would have been funnier if I hadn't ruined it myself. Should I follow the bloody footprints? Dunno. Hello. First aid spray. Thanks. Let's say take you to full health. If so, awesome. Keep out. Maybe not. Okay. <laughs> How do you know you're a horror protagonist? You immediately pull the lever that has a keep out next to it. I'm anticipating a jump scare in three, two, one, jump scare. For reference, I know only some of what happens in this game, because I've watched a playthrough of it, but it's been since it came out, and I have memory issues. Okay, we need a fuse. Under no circumstances should you ever, police officer or otherwise, put put yourself under a keep out that you can't get back out of. Or just a keep out in general. You know, they typically say keep out for good reason. That's creepy. I love it. Just looking for ammo. I might have to mess with the brightness. I know it's meant to be dark, but blind. Don't see any people in there. I just hear some faint, creepy noises back there. I'm. I appreciate they had the restraint to not immediately jump scare me though when I opened up the keep out place. That shows some restraint. Also, keep my gun drawn. Oh, I hate that. 
Opening doors like that is going to get me bitten in the future. I can feel it. No peoples. And there clearly used to be, with all the sleeping bags around. How long has this been happening? Like the... Because I know this was supposed to be our first day. I think... I, that's meta-knowledge, I know. He doesn't know. Uh, I, I've not been told it yet, but I know it. Uh, because I read the, the screen on the front. <laughs> where it says it. Uh, where it says it. But, uh... Like, how do they not... I guess they were kind of... Powerless. A. Hey. I love how there's the option to turn that off again. Like, under what circumstance... Oh! How did I miss that? Hello? Thanks for the bullets. Don't come to life. Oh, it is a nice satisfying 15 in green to tell me that it's full ammo so I never have to wonder. See, that's a good quality of life feature. What? Why can't I turn this off? No, please turn that on. <laughs> Don't get up. If you get up, I'm going to get pissed. And if I get pissed, you might get pissed old. <laughs> I love all of them. There we go. Okay, there is a way to make the door open like a... That's... Ugh! Stay open, you old frickin' door. No surprise zombies behind us. Let's move forward. Cleaning in progress. Not anymore. <laughs> this is red, therefore I approach it. I'm like a frickin' moth. No, it's not moths that are... What? There's some bug that's attracted to red light. I don't remember what it is. Problem with being intellectual but having bad memory is you remember half of lots of fun facts. Oh, sorry, I can't go in there. I mean, I can't. Leon can't. I'm not limited by your basic bitch binary genders. What's in here? I hear bugs, so I'm expecting corpses. Corpse? No corpse. I'm ready for jump scare. Hit me. No. Neat. No reflection, though. I per People always check for game reflections. I just kind of... Oh, these don't stack. Yikes. Uh, I kind of just always live under the assumption... Oh, that one's full. It wasn't bugs I was hearing. It was an overfilled toilet going... <laughs> Also, I realized I just swore, but it was funny, so. <laughs> if there had been a jump scare in there, I would have been able to make the funniest joke of all time. But oh well. I don't know why I care so much about being funny. Maybe because it makes me feel happy. Make them laugh, make them laugh. Please don't attack me. These look very thoroughly shot. Open up. Hurry. Oh, hi. Open Hello. Hi. I chimed in with a haven't you people ever heard of. Hurry. Open nice. the goddamn door, no. I got you. Uh, uh, we did a very bad job of opening this door. Oh my god. Tell him hang in there! He's getting eaten! Hang out there! Oh, that's worse. Oh, that is so much worse than getting eaten while I was getting split in half! Uh, actually, I don't know if that's better or not. I told you, if we were his reinforcements, he was screwed. Officer's notebook. Put three things in the goddess statue, then you can get out through the parking lot, but watch out. There's a vague drawing of the horse statue. 
Oh, with solutions for the combinations. Very nifty. Thank you. Are you going to turn as a torso? I genuinely don't know. Because I've watched Resident Evil. I don't know how much this is... Whoa! Hello! You don't have a face, so you should be fine? You should be dead. Do I double tap you? I don't know if double tapping you even prevents you from coming back. So I'd rather wait for you to come back, because I don't know how this game does that. Also, you weren't here earlier. Which means you got in some... Like that! Okay. Well... How about... Oh god, we have to go through this door, don't we? Nope, we don't. We can't. Give me a quick QTE, I'm ready. Nope. Okay. No QTE, I just get bit. Thanks. Love that. Was I supposed to open that? Nope, I'm not. Okay, bye. Peace out, Cub Scouts. Be better with the aiming of your flashlight. Oh, hi again. I didn't see you. Caution. I might just get killed here because I can't see where the hell I'm supposed to go. Final stand in the bathroom? Really? I have 17 bullets. They don't seem like 17 bullet ready. That one's stuck in the stall for now? Stay stuck. You're down. You fell down in a weird way. We got more? I got more. Bye. You're dead, I think. This one's a little stuck, but unfortunately perfectly healthy. Ooh, well done. You dead? Nope! No, you are not dead! Oh my good god! <laughs> oh, that scared me so bad! How are you not dead, my man? You better be. You're not. I have one bullet. And not much of a throat left. I'm in the lowest possible health. Let's get out of here alive, heal up, and cry about it later. That's not the way we want to go. I hear the... When music gets faster, I move faster. Er, er. Yep, I hear you. I never found that. Is there going to be a jump scare zombie on this side? Yes. No, it's at my leg. Save me, cutscene. Yes! Power of cutscene. Squash him? Yeah. Hi there. Am I really safe for now, though? Hey, the galaxy's playing Tetris. Here. I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. I did. I used up basically all of my ammo. Does anyone know what started this? Trying to save myself and everyone else. Last week, and I got a call to stay away. Oh, there we go. I wish I'd come here sooner. Got a call to stay away. We should have stayed away. They were right. Hey, Lieutenant, I'm ready. Hopefully, you'll be able to find a way out of the station. That officer you met earlier, Ellie, he thought this secret passageway might be a trick. This is good news. 
can get you to hospital. No, no, I am not priority three. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. Me. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out. Or you run. Got it? Agree. Hopefully now we can defend ourselves instead of just getting bitten like a champ. Champ? No. What's the word? I'm looking for a word. It's definitely not champ. It's the inverse of that. Chump. That's the one. Combat knife. Equip it on the inventory screen to use. Wears down with use. It will break when its gauge is depleted. Oh, that sucks. If you use the counterattack space when you're caught by an enemy, it can only be retrieved once you defeat them. That sucks. A little bit. Alright, we need to give myself health. Health monitor is in... Pew pew Tetris. <laughs> P.I.O. P.I.O. Tetris. Uh, sorry, it's steam overlay. As you take damage, your health monitor in the bottom left will drop from fine to caution to danger. While in danger, quickly heal yourself with a green herb or first aid spray before it's too late. I would like to restore to full health, please. Yos. Yay. I need more bullet. Do you have bullet, sir? Three. No, what is that? Oh, it's part of the map, I think. Blinking. We got the combinate the answer to that from this, right? I think I need to put a thing in it first, though. We need to find more bullet. Unfortunately, I will have to go back through there at some point. Can I use my knife on this? I can. Hopefully that doesn't use durability. If it does, I will be slightly salty. It does not, thank God. No. Most people imagine their first day, you know, going terribly, but not quite end of the world terribly. Unless you have as much paranoia as I do. <laughs> and then you start thinking about, like, okay, in an emergency, what can I do? Even if that emergency makes no logical sense to exist. Like an apocalypse. That's a lot of bullet. Thank you. I'm afraid to look out the windows. Because we saw that one zombie just slap the window open like it was nothing. This place is not very secure. Nor has it been very well secured. Which makes sense due to the wounded state of the people inside of it. I hate these doors. I They're definitely there to help add to the horror. Okay, this is the scariest hallway of all time. Okay, maybe not of all time. There have been a lot of scary hallways in history. That person's dead. I know that much. I've seen movie. I kind of want to preemptively pop around in him before he gets up. You're not alive. If, okay, calling it now, if this thing is dead, I'm upset. If this thing is undead, because I just put a bullet in it. Why? What are you doing? You've witnessed zombies before. If this one's still, like, not fully dead... I have questions. What? Why is that one hanging from the ceiling by its throat? Oh, I have so much strong nope energy. Yeah, you're dead dead, which is good. I unfortunately did waste a bullet. What hung you up by your throat? I unfortunately don't have... I guess I can fix that. I don't know if I want to know what hung you up by your throat. You need a green club key get into the club, you know? That's a... Oh, no. I... I have meta-knowledge that Leon does not. Open window. You hate to see that. 
I don't have boards. I could just hop out that window, but I'd probably be swarmed and die. Actually, I can't hop out that window. Leon can't. Oh, frick. I'm just gonna walk past you. Really? Stay down. Doors. I like doors. But there's a zombie out in the hallway. So I'm just gonna try and break through this door. So I don't have a ton of time. Record of events. 25th. Oh, okay. I probably should not be doing this right now. Mob attack the station, resulting in casualties. Another clash on the west side. 12 people died. Only a handful of survivors left. Yeah, because I've got this problem. Hi. You gonna move, mother fricker? You better not. You better not. Okay, you're dead. You're kinda just chilling. <laughs> he died in such a funny stance. Gotta find humor in the end of the world, you know? Otherwise, other people will find humor in your end at the end of the world. Hey, police station 1F map. Search completed. Oh, I did a good job! I searched completed basically that whole secret area. Not a secret area, that whole crappy area. I, I was thinking of the S word. And, and not secret, but I also decided not to say it. And then there's that, which I'll get to. I feel like this door is a problem. Oh, it's shackled. Question, can I combine you? You two. Mix herbs, GG. Medium amount of health. I got the basics of survival for that. Oh no. For the record, I don't want to be doing that. Cause yeah, I heard you. You're hopefully dead dead. Let's check check. Yep, you are. Thank you. Thank you for your service towards aiding my survival. I would like to knife this one, if I can. That was not very effective. Whoa! That was... that was controls, that was not me. I was trying to knife him and it did not let... want me to. Hold the knife. Oh, you have to hold space. Space. Okay. That's terrible usage of that. Son of a bitch. I agree. Whoa, that used up a lot of its durability. I should have put on easy baby mode. Because I am a baby. No, I'm not. I'm just easy. <laughs> Why did I say that? You're alive? I literally just pulled a knife out of you. Stop breathing. Well, I mean, you're not breathing. You're undead, but... You knew what I meant. Locked. Or stuck. Nope. Just bad door. Hello. Why are you missing keys? Like, why are you missing buttons? <laughs> Is this going to explain why you're missing buttons? Yes. <laughs> it appears that the key keypad to the locker. Is missing a few keys. I suggest the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys and fix this right now. You knew who you are, you bastard. Who else f this up this badly? <laughs> it immediately answered my question. I appreciate that, at least. Uh, can I save partway through? Look, I can load records. Okay, I can't... I assume I can't save from here. Obstacles obtained. Welcome to the city of the dead. Oh, unlockables obtained. Okay. Oh, I, oh, I get like cool concept art. That's neat. Um. Two o three. I assume you're missing the two or the three. The two and the three. Nifty. One o two. Something. 103, another knife. 104 is nothing. 106. I can open that, I think. 109. 
Let's try 106 and 109. I'm hurt, aren't I? I'm fine. Okay, I'm fine. I'll wait till I'm not fine. Cheers. I don't have two or the three. Sorry. Roll of film. Please be a lot of bullets. It's not. I need a weapons locker key card. That's not the key card I got earlier, unfortunately. Because that wasn't a key card I got earlier, that was just a notebook. We have company. Hi there. Where's your warrant? I need your warrant. Or I need your face. It's up to you. Warrant or face? Warrant or face? It's face. <laughs> you dead? I hope you're dead. Because I want to take a sip of my Dr. Pepper really badly. Also, I'm writing something down to remind myself for later today that I almost forgot. Alright. Sticky note for future trip. You aren't dead! I was right! I like being right. I missed. That's, I think that's my first missed shot. Can I, like, finish you off if you're downed? No, I cannot. So the knife just sucks, doesn't it? Jesus. <laughs> Pop! Good? You dead? You don't have a you don't have a head left, so you better be freaking dead. Does the hat have physics? No. Though I kinda have to walk around it for some reason. 203 is backpack. What's this? 208. Shotgun bullet. Shotgun seems nice, but shotgun also sounds like it will not be very effective. Because knife is like the best thing you want in an apocalypse. You want a good, consistent melee weapon that you can just consistently kill things with. And it's terrible at that. If you make a move for me... <laughs> okay, no, you're not. Out into the hallway. off. Don't think I don't hear you. I should probably get away from it so it stops aggroing, right? Is that how this works? I killed you. You're very dead. I killed you twice, in fact, so you better be very dead. I also don't know if the game pauses in here. Yeah, I know. Uh, there's the lockers terminal. Yeah, I'm not done with that room. Operations is up here. But I would like to make it out to the West Hall and save, so that's behind me. That's blocked. There should be a door here into the West Office that I could use to cut through. Hello? You are probably undead. Uses of gunpowder. Two gunpowder makes a handgun. A... Uh, Gun plus a yellow makes a shotgun. Two yellows makes a mag. Not a lot of ammo around to make you use a gunpowder. Gunpowder? Gunpowder. I don't want to move towards the zombie because he's definitely not dead. Bullet. Put it in the gun. Jolly. That's one gunpowder, so I can't make any bullets out of that. I hate walking into scares. See? He's alive. What's up? You've got a nice, perfect target around your throat that I plan to use. 
Because it seem, doesn't seem to help where I shoot you in the head. Don't move. I do appreciate that mostly it's one at a time or it's a frick ton at a time. I didn't even notice that before. That could have got me so killed. Or at least hurt. But it can take him a long time to stop playing dead. These guys are... I don't know why I did that. These guys are actually quite scary. I approve. You're not dead dead, are you? You don't look dead dead. I don't see any wounds on you that would make you dead. It's another safe. I don't want to waste a bullet. Are you dead? Oh, Jesus. You're not. Shocker, I know. Are you dead? I can't tell. You ragdoll. I feel like this one's playing dead. Correct. This one's playing dead. Hello! Don't need no stinking gun. I assume that's for killing a zombie with a knife? Yes, defeat an enemy with a knife. I told you! I like knives! If anyone was going to make a knife work, it was frickin' me. I don't know where I get this combination. I don't I assume I don't have it. I know you're dead now. Are you dead? You do actually seem dead. You also are in a very interesting position. Operations report. I suggest we escape through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel in this place left over from its museum days. There's no proof there's even a tunnel or that the sewers aren't infested with zombies. How would a tunnel become infested with zombies? Answer me that, Elliot. Edwards. Who I presume is now dead, like everyone else. I don't know I'm talking trash to someone who's definitely dead. I heard a growl. Could have been through there. What is through there? Reception. Reception was clear. I, I, also, I know I'm not done in here, game. I do appreciate it, you telling me that. Rookie's first assignment. Putting you on a very special assignment for your first assignment. <laughs> I read that super wrong. <laughs> We're putting you on a very first assignment for your first assignment. Uh, unlock your desk. The key is the, first, is the initials of our first names. Input the letters in order of our desks. There are two locks, one for each side of your desks. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your task is to remember your few fellow officers' names. You figured that out, right? Good luck. By the way, it might take a little while to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Bronan. Scrawled in a corner with between drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Okay, it's a real puzzle. I told you this game had these. Welcome, Leon. Really sad with the benefit of hindsight. Alright, let me read the note again. Because I was only half paying attention to what I was reading. First names. M. From Marvin. Hopefully not you. Is that Rita Phillips? Oh god, reading. The zombie I just killed. This one. I need his first name, but his first name's not on his desk. Oh, I can push in his chair. <laughs> oh, odd. Yeah, push your chair in before you die, you sloppy son of a bitch. <laughs> this is quite fun. Uh, so it's M R force. <laughs> Uh, what's the... 
My first break-in. Hooray. What was that for? Open a dial safe. whoop de doo me David Ford. So D. E. Elliot Edward. I was trash-talking you earlier. Look, another brute force. Can I push your chair in? I just realized the L fell off. No, it didn't. There's an extra L. Why is there an extra L? Did Elliot Edward think Welcome had two L's in it? <laughs> okay, maybe it was a, maybe I was right to trash talk him earlier. If you thought Welcome had two L's in it. I shouldn't make fun of the dead, but sometimes it's really funny and I do it anyways. There's also a bag on your de uh, chair that I can't seem to get. But, uh... Oh, here we go. Neil. E? It is D-E-N. Den. Ned. If you don't read backwards. High capacity mag for Matilda. Does it work on you? I can't combine it with the fun DLC gun I got. 24 rounds. Alright, so there is a reason for me to use that other pistol. A lot of bullets. I wish I could see, like, the stats. It's called the Samurai Edge. But uh, I think that's where we're going to call it for the first episode. We've solved a puzzle, we've made fun of a dead man, and we've had quite a fun time in this little police department. If you're enjoying it, be sure to watch it on twitch.tv forward slash it's AAA gaming if you're watching on YouTube, and otherwise, when you're watching here, well, keep watching. Hello, what's happening? It's that man in black and green, sometimes sweet and saccharine, sometimes he bees as mad as me. Insanity, persistently, forever 